Well, I've sneaked over to the super stage to talk to a fantastic photographer, Mary Ellen Mark. Now, Mary Ellen, I don't like to put labels and tags on other photographers, so would you like to put your own tag? What kind of photographer do you see yourself as? Well, I'm a documentary photographer and a portrait photographer. So documentary and portrait photographer, and I know that you have, um, you know, you have an amazing career behind you, and you've done some pretty special things within that career. Is there anything particular that sticks in your mind? Well, it's always the next thing you're going to do that sticks in your mind. Because I, and I've been very lucky; I've had a chance to do so many interesting projects. But right now, we're working on a, a film and a book about Tiny, the girl from Streetwise, uh, who. Is a, 13 years old when I met her. We followed her for over 30 years. So she was a prostitute uh, at, at 12, actually. And the book follows her life, the film follows her life. She has 10 children now. So it's about her and her family. And it, it's, it's sort of, I guess, first in my heart and mind at this moment. Okay, and so why, why photography for you? And, you know, when, when did you first engage with it? Was it as a, as a child? At what, at what point did that, the bug strike you? Well, I always loved taking pictures as a child, but I didn't think I thought of myself as a photographer. But when I graduated from university, I went to a graduate school that had a course in photography in, at uh, Annenberg School at the University of Pennsylvania, and that's... I fell in love from the moment I started to do it. I knew that's what I had to do and found my passion. You found your passion, absolutely. And your passion is, you know, as I say, it's trying to, I guess with photojournalism, it's about truth, isn't it? Is that, is that what you, you're trying to portray in your work? It's about reality. So explain reality then. Kind of what, what do you mean by that? Well, it's about, it's about people. It's about who they are, who they really are, how they live. Um, their soul and their heart. Um, I guess I've always, uh, you know, been in most interested and cared about people. So my pictures are about people. So do you feel, you know, when you're with your work that you you're trying to often, you know, you were talking about the project that you're that you're you've been engaged in and the, the book that you've done. Is it about getting to know people over a long period of time with a lot of your work, rather than just fleeting kind of um, I don't know chance encounters with people, or is it both? It's about getting to know people, but you know, in a lot of things you do, you don't really have a chance to get to know people. Like like when I photographed the circus, I went from many circuses and I didn't really get to know the people. You know, I got to know them for a week here and there. But with this current project uh, and film, it, it's someone that I do know. It's, it's interesting photographing a family and over so many years. You just kind of start your work, you're there, and then you come back and it's like you never left. No, oh, that, that, that's really interesting. Now, I understand um, you, I, that you, you haven't, you know, you're not shooting digitally. You still, you still want to and enjoy shooting with film. Is there, is there any particular re reason for that? Well, uh, first of all, I think I'm too old to change. I don't believe that for a second. Come on, Mary Ellen. But, but it's a different mindset. It's a different mindset. I think it is. And I have this incredible printmaker I work with in the States, and, and he, he just recently made me these incredible, beautiful prints on, on Ilford paper, actually. It's silver gelatin prints, and I just like the whole process. I like the whole process of analog. I do have, you know, a couple of very good digital cameras, but I still can't leave without my Leica M6 or my, or my you know, Maybe a, maybe a seven. I still feel that I, I need to capture it in analog. Okay, that's interesting. And you, you love analog print, okay. And I, you told me a little bit earlier that you obviously you flew in yesterday, you, you, you're flying out tomorrow. Um, what, what's next for you? What's your, what's your next shoot gonna be? Where are you gonna be? Uh, well, we're going back to Seattle on Friday to work more with, with Tiny, the girl that, that, from Streetwise. And you, are you looking forward to doing that? Yes, I'm always looking forward to working with her. Okay, and, and, and in your talk, you're, you're covering a whole breadth of your work right, right the way through, through your career? From the very beginning, a long time ago. Brilliant stuff. I 
I'm too old to change. <laughs> no, no, you're not. Never, never too old to change. Um, thank you very much, Mary Ellen Mark. It was fantastic to meet you. And I know I'm, I'm watching people at the end, um, you know, coming up to you, you, you si signing, you know, signing their books with their work. They, they, everybody clearly admires your work. So thank you for coming to England.